Hello friends and welcome back to yet another very very interesting video on negotiation skills. This is a continuation of my previous video on the same subject. In this video, I am going to talk about very interesting stories based on situations of negotiation skills. Let's go back to our previous video for a moment. If you recall, we have talked about four different situations. I win and you lose like a battlefield. No, we don't want that. I lose and you win. We don't want that either. Or I lose and you lose like an ego tussle. Both parties lose. It doesn't help, does it? What exactly we are looking at is the win-win situation that we spoke about in our previous video. That's so very important for negotiation. Here is a story of a friend of mine, Mike, who has been working in a software company for the last six years. When he first joined his job, this company called El Terreno Private Limited, they were selling a software which is an antivirus to various clients in bulks. The name of the software was Webster Magic. The name of the software was Webster Magic. So he was trying to sell this Webster Magic to different clients. In his first few months when he was new and those days his company was also new, the product was newly launched as well, he visited a client. He visited a client to sell 90 antivirus licenses, 90, 90, at a price of 1,75,000 rupees. Client wanted it at a price of 1,25,000 only. He called up his seniors, he was new to the job, the product was new in the market, his company was new. So his seniors and him discussed and then they very easily sold those 90 licenses without much negotiation at 1,25,000 as the client wanted it. When they went back, sat down, they realized they made a loss of 30,000 rupees. They felt bad about it. It was not a good deal. It was a I lose and you win situation. Client was happy. They were not happy. Come a few months later, maybe a year later, this time he went to another client. His company was now a bit established. People knew about the product. He was also one year old almost. This time he wanted to sell 150 licenses at 3 lakh rupees. Client said no, we want it at 2 lakh rupees. Negotiated hard, neither uh, wanted to shift any positions. Unfortunately, the deal couldn't go ahead. Later, a month later, the client bought the same 150 licenses from another company, another product, at 2,55,000 rupees only. And he also sold 150 licenses to another client of his at 2,48,000 rupees. So I am quite amazed that why didn't he negotiate and why didn't the client negotiate now that they end up paying more the client paid more and he also sold it at a lesser amount than initially that 3 lakh that he quoted and also client wanted it at 2 lakh and he bought it at a much higher price uh, a month later so it was a I lose you lose you lose I lose both parties lost out it was not an ideal situation case 3 he went to another client down the line couple of years later he was well into the market he was experienced guy this time he wanted to sell 200 licenses at 387000 rupees but the client wanted 1 lakh 150 licenses only uh, he told the client that i'm not ready to negotiate on 150 licenses i can only give you a discount or negotiate on if you buy 200 only client was not happy but he said, okay, fine, could save some money, maybe those extra licenses would be used somewhere else. So finally, he gave a deal of 350000 for 200 licenses and the client had to buy those 200 licenses, although he got a deal 
he got a discount but he was not happy because he had to buy 50 extra and uh, he promised himself that I'm not going to buy anything from these people again so in this situation he was very happy Mike was very happy but the client wasn't so I win and you lose the outcome is not good in the future come fourth situation he was a seasoned guy five years down the line he went to a client to sell 400 licenses antivirus licenses at 9 lakh 20 thousand rupees client wanted it at a price of 7 lakh 10 thousand only they negotiated hard client wanted to raise the amount to 7 lakh 50 thousand he reduced the amount to 8 lakh 75 thousand from 9 lakh 20 thousand for those 400 licenses still negotiations were on because the client wanted it at 7 lakh 50 and he couldn't give it below 8 lakh 75 so he gave the client a deal he said sir i'm going to give you not 400 415 licenses i'm going to give you 15 extra three months after sales service and one month extension on the expiry date of those licenses so you're getting 415 licenses at a price of 8 lakh 75 thousand three months after sales service and one month of extra uh, one month period where it expires and also one month warranty extension the client was happy that he was getting 15 more he was getting after sales service he was getting extensions he was happy that he made a good deal so both parties were happy he was happy client was happy client was happy he was happy later on he got more business from the client because this was a perfect example of a win-win situation so i hope that i have been made able to make you understand that uh, what is this win-win situation is all about through these four stories where case one it was clearly a situation where he lost and the client won so i lose you win we don't want that case two was clearly a situation where the client also lost out he also lost out so lose lose situation that's really we don't want that case three was he was happy client was not happy so that situation absolutely we don't want fourth situation where the client was happy and he was happy win-win he felt like a winner client felt like a winner he understood the client need he empathized with the client he built a relationship he took the perspective of the client into account to make a proposal he gave a proposal which the client couldn't refuse he felt like a winner so end of the day the question is every situation that we are in whether it's an employee employer situation it's a husband wife situation it's company a and company b whether it's a client and a particular company whether it's a union and a government body doesn't matter we need to create that win-win situation where both parties feel like a winner thank you so much once again for watching my video please do call me at 8017205457 email me at nagsudeep08 at the rate gmail.com my name is Sudeep Nag I am a corporate trainer I have 12 years plus experience in soft skill and corporate training inbound outbound training I am from Kolkata do avail my services for your employees and thank you so much wish you a wonderful day ahead be well Keep well, God bless.